We start here on the local front where the Central Disaster Safety Countermeasure Headquarters announced additional antivirus measures earlier on this Wednesday. Now, amid forecasts that the daily COVID-19 tally may surpass 100,000 in the near future, authorities are banning in-person visits to venues vulnerable to infection such as nursing hospitals and related facilities. Also, staff at these facilities must receive a PCR test once a week. The government is also going to add some 70 more testing stations nationwide and secure some 4,000 more hospital beds for COVID-19 patients. Meanwhile, the Korea Disease Control and Prevention Agency says South Korea had reported 76,402 new COVID-19 infections, including 429 from overseas as of midnight Wednesday. The agency adds the Omicron subvariant BA5 accounted for more than half of the country's total COVID-19 cases in the third week of July from up from, that is, 24% in the first week of the month.